Hello everyone, I'm Count Zero. It's taking a bit for the chat to come up. Once it comes up, I will be a little more actively involved in the chat. We are continuing to Mass Effect Andromeda. Um, we are heading back to Vold. There's a lead there on the Asari arc. So we're going to work on that. We also have a few people to chat to chat with on the ship to continue moving along our loyalty missions. I do like the score for the game. Nice mix of synths and orchestral, and it distinguishes itself really well from the score for Mass Effect, or the original Mass Effect trilogy. So we might have a few start team missions completed since the last time I was here. Success! Uh, they've leveled up too. All right. All right. That expires really soon. Let's do this one next. Oh, hey. Silver loot box. Uh, not a good chance of getting it though. We still live our guys up for more. All right, November is a good chance of pulling off this one. You want more? What's that? Uh, Made Avenger. Cash. Chitin. Chitin. Alright, um, so the salvage I have on there, I have an extra assault rifle that I don't need, I've got two of these darn things. Um, none of those equipped, so... That is not as good as my current assault rifle. This is an ultra rare one. You know the receiver and the scope, it can't be like yeah, I'm still... This one can go... Older Emmy Avenger... The Matok. Well, 
Let's take this bad boy back and let's stick some mods in it to see if it can boost my current gun. How long does it take to learn piloting? Depends how you rule up. How about that? I talk and then mods. Recent damage but recent distance drops my clip size though. I can live with that. Slight drop the clip size, particularly if I I'll drop the stability though. I want accuracy. Try that bad boy. Do I have any other options for sniper rifles? No. Okay, so... Joel wanted to talk to me. Trouble. There we go. So, Jal. So, so. We haven't had a chance to talk alone. You comfortable in here? I took it. I took it. it feels strange to stay with the others. They are, you are, aliens. Yep. And you're alien to us. So, there. We have something in common. Uh, we can look at it as a place to start. Sure. Got it. Perhaps then, if we're all aliens, aliens it's, about, it's about what kind of alien we are. You had no idea about us, but you signed up to help us anyway. Perhaps it had nothing to do with you. Is that all you've got? Now that I've proven you can trust me, I was hoping you'd feel more able to open up. I have certain dissatisfactions that I'd like to leave behind. They're quite personal. They're quite personal. How do you know Moshe Sefa? She's our greatest mind on the Remnant. I was his student. Uh -huh. You studied the Remnant too? A little. I was terrible. I quit. Or she threw me out. <laughs> We're still very close. Got it? So. Wow, awkward! It is now. It's Ket. With my own modifications. I like to tinker, to get my hands on something and take it apart. That's a skill I know we can use. But I have one request. Please don't take apart my ship. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. I signed up. Uh, volunteered for this. It's... Uh, Exciting. There's something unique about you. Uneasy, raw, but somehow profound. Face value? That sounds like a compliment. Yes, it does. A nice one. It is. Angara feel deeply. We have <laughs> more trouble hiding our emotions than showing them. Uh. I should get back to my work. I'm not going to flirt. And it's not the heart icon, so. When we have downtime, I'd love to watch you work. Sure. I could show everyone. Um, no. Just us. So we can get to know each other better, or just share a hobby. Oh. Mm. Yeah. Good. Good. That's not me flirting, because I've already picked, kind of decided on PB as my uh, go to. Relationships. All right, I 
And talk chat with Liam. Pathfinder. Hey, I was wondering, could you put your stamp on a project? It's for me and Jarl to work on. Call it diplomacy if you have to put it in a budget bucket. Greenlight that research and it's all good. Sure thing. Just wondering what you think of how I'm doing at the job. I'm committed to the initiative. Your pathfinder. It's as simple as it okay. is. Okay. We'll talk later. I know. I know it. I was hoping for the. For, ah, okay. We got, I've got like two build quests I got to do. That reminds me. So. All right. Research center under a special category because I have to build like two different armor things. Oh, hey, I can build that just right now. So head down the elevator, the ladder. I prefer this way of handling ladder movement than with the uh, Mass Effect 3, just because it kind of streamlines the process some. Starboard. Smart stuff up front, powers and back. <laughs> Liam, I signed off on that project. That's great, Pathfinder. Jala Maldorov, we got our gear. Golster, Ryder. <laughs> Apparently we just got tickets to the gun show. I'll bite. Hey! <laughs> We're swapping armor. Don't let him tease you. I explain the reference. <laughs> Ready to go? Go. Right. Pass on your pauldron. Family honorific. Can I wear the poncho? It's a rough shin. And no. Why? Is it religious? Wait, what? It's personal. You're not allowed. Because of status? Or species. Maybe it's So is this like do all humans look alike? Some of you sound alike. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So is it diplomacy by comparing how armor designs work? I thought this was about armor. Are you deliberately trying to offend y'all? Um uh, of course he is. That's the point. Asking stuff diplomats leave out. Armor for answers. I my turn was earlier. Nexus info packets leave a lot out. Uh. I am sorry. Uh, was this not sanctioned? Yeah, you weaseling Adi. Nevertheless, Ryder. Uh. I hope you know what you're doing. I don't need the Nexus. <laughs> that is awesome. Relax. Jar won't complain to HR or whatever Tan thinks we report to. We were joking around and realized we didn't know how to insult each other. Or how not. Aha. Uh -huh. Some things are so ingrained, they're invisible. We didn't even know the warning signs, so we got it over with. Now we won't do it accidentally. Like when we're trying to negotiate an outpost. Enough of his people want to shoot us now. Okay. That actually makes sense. It is important. It is kind of important when learning a language to know the profanity and the insults. So you know not to so you don't you don't say them on accident. 
Okay, I kind of get the intent. No harm, no foul. <laughs> if Jar was offended, I'd be on the floor. I'll take that kind of honest any day. We have a lot to learn. That's part of what our team is for. <laughs> Better now than when people's lives are on the line. <laughs> I kind of like the idea of the of doing the um, alphabetized uh, <laughs> uh, insult game from uh, for the first Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie. Huh? We're we gonna end up using this for a mission or something. Is a uh, EVA pod? Arrogant son of a bitch. Maybe that's redundant for a cat. <sighs> He's also the first cat who bothered to talk to us. That's useful intel. True. True. They can communicate. They just prefer to open yep. fire. So, what else is new? How's the search for the Asari Ark going? Those Asari refugees were a real help. Now to find the survey ship they mentioned. All right. See you later, Cora. I'll be here. Okay. All right. Next stop, back to Vold. Oh, hello, PB. I did not like the look of that Archon. Maybe the Angara will let me pitch a tent on Aya for the duration. You'd let a bone-faced blowhard like that deprive you of my scintillating company. That blowhard hates you now. If you're not careful, he might deprive me of your company. <sighs> All right. Next time, keep him on the line. I might have something. I'm glad we got that dialogue there this time. Is there more about Kalinda you want to share? Back home, she was upper crust, an ambassador, respected. Living the high life, but miserable. Not built for royalty, she said. With her position, the initiative sought her out as a first contact specialist. First wave out of stasis. Kalinda was the one who got me thought out early. I'm so grateful for that. But things went south soon. She hurt me. Oh, badly. What happened? Oh, let's not drum up that sob story. It's all water under the bridge. By which we mean it's... Still actually a sore point, and she doesn't want to talk about it right now. Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. Everyone says you know it when we do the talk again later. Ah, there you are. Gotcha. Do I need to get Lexi to do a psych <laughs> review? <laughs> Maybe. People have been telling me I'm crazy my whole life. Just dealing with some scourge issues. That Archon fella tried to warn you not to joyride into it, but you were just la la la. It was an act first, think later move. I respect it. Well, more like I resemble it. <sighs> hey, you play poker? Come again? Poker. Card game, bluffing, betting. It's an age-old measuring stick of a person's character, fortitude, guts. Used to think maybe it was my calling. Turns out I'm just good at it. Never lost, heads up. We should play sometime. Well, we had the card game in Mass Effect in um, Dragon Age Inquisition with um, all our party members there, so sure. Card game among members of the Normandy, why not? Willing to put your streak on the line? Huh. I'll risk it. Next time we pulled up and you're in the mood, I'm always in the mood. <laughs> I don't want to hail um, the boss yet. All right.
tracking a remnant architect. Oh, that's what ended up in orbit too. I presume I assume that taking out the thing leads to um clearing out the uh uh, hang on, but take down the thing because it repro reprogram. It gets it reprogrammed. It gets it more involved in keeping the uh, planetary environment maintained. I was probably giving this more thought than the developers did, but that's okay. I like giving the scientific world building a little more thought. Sounds like fun. It was desperate. We won, but only barely. Old Orbit is steady. Yep, bring us down. We got core on the bar core and drac, perfect. I like the XP boost. I do not like these helmet designs. The fusion helmet's better than the interrogator helmet. I like the Deep Space Explorer gear a little bit more. Approaching the LZ. It's the first time we've like this first time we've landed on Vold once we set up the base. All right, so That darn thing's over here. Fast travel out that way. Picking up a faint signal. Looks like a friendly ship. It matches the transponder code for Asari survey vessel, Peri Fona. That's the ship Hadaria mentioned. We might be close. I'm reading a temperature decrease. Yes, and noted. You can extract minerals by your mining interface. You know what I like in the patch? Um Hostiles ahead. To have less of those reminders.
Well, the hostiles, but I ain't seen nothing. Do some lithium though. Oh, back on the ride. So we have of the possible sites. to do that's Dukes of Hazard this bad boy. Whoa 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 pretty sure the AI rule book doesn't insist the Pathfinder always gets to drive. All right, so I need to back up. Who taught you to shoot, Harper? Your stance is all over the place. It's a Karita stance. Classic for Asari commandos, but it's not for everyone. A Krogan, for example, would look like a whale trying to dance. <laughs> Better than looking like a Salarian tied to a ceiling fan. Ah, oh, darn, I thought I had enough speed to do Dukes of Hazard jump this bad boy. Woohoo! Ah, the rocks killed my momentum. On the other side of that. Weird tire animation. Some, some of my parts weren't made for these temperatures. <laughs> Alright. There we go. False signal. One down. Okay. All right, next two are over this way. So we'll hit a fast travel point. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Oh, only at the moment. Life support is stable. Let's go this one next. So you're 1,400 years old? Most of me, bits drop off, stuff gets added. That's still a long time. Longer than a sorry even. I had a lot of bastards to outlive, you know how it is. Oh hey, cargo cash.
New shotgun. Like a really, really good shotgun. Pathfinder, this remnant site may have defense systems. Which one am I headed to? Headed to this one. Okay. There. Cat signals detected ahead. Pathfinder. Take a detour. We need to fight you right now. This is the source of the periphonus signal. Oh god. And there's Ket on sight. Clear them out. There are way too many goons here. All right, you know what? You're getting sniped. There we go, and now I have cover. Ah, oh, I was going to attack him with melee. Clear. There you are. Okay. That's the periphone, all right. What's left of her? Definitely Ket weapons fire. This wasn't just a crash. The Ket pulverized the ship. No survivors. Darn. If we'd been faster, we could have. Damn it. But this is stupid. The Ket take prisoners. Why kill the crew? Yeah, because if this is actually a good point, because any either they convert them or they turn them into slave labor. It's like they saw the Perifona itself as a threat. But it's no match for a cat cruiser. When you're ready for payback, we got something. Looks like, looks like a flight recorder. It's in bad shape. But let's see what... Final log. If the Ark ever finds this, we failed. Couldn't draw them off. The data copy's lost. 
The decimation is too cunning. Forgive us. We try. The decimation. Hadaria mentioned specialized cat hunters. Maybe that's them. This is true. They do love their fancy titles. They've got to be cat with a name like that. I hope they choke on it. We'll make them choke on it. Lieutenant, the time the navigational record could be reconstructed. Right. We could trace the Paraphona's flight path, maybe all the way back to the Ark. I'll take a look when we get back. Still lots to do.